are ya? Welcome to this week's vlog. It is another socially isolated vlog. It is currently March 27th. I believe we're on day like 10 or 11 of this social isolation here in Los Angeles. But I do have a couple fun things planned for this weekend, starting with a game night tonight with my family online, a virtual game night. Also, I wanna to try to take Max on a very long walk, but I wanted to start the vlog now because something so funny just happened. First, let me say that within this uh, isolating time, I cracked and I made a TikTok, and I don't really know how TikTok works, but I made one, and if you have a TikTok, we should be friends? Is that how that works? I don't know. You, you're friends on Facebook, you follow each other on Instagram, I don't know. Whatever. Nevertheless, <laughs> it's the, my same as my Instagram, so it's at Mikkel Jancy Smith. Mikkel underscore Jancy underscore Smith. And I posted onto TikTok what just happened, but let me just put the little clip in this video. So there's just this ladder that popped up on our porch, and this man just jumped onto our porch and started moving our furniture. How are you not barking at him? <laughs> Have you not noticed? Out of nowhere, I was, I was literally making lunch for Brooke and this ladder just like pops up and I was like, what? We live basically on the third floor. <laughs> it's the second floor, but the first floor is like the leasing office and stuff. Um, and then the second floor is the first floor. So we technically live on the third floor. And this guy just climbs over and starts moving our furniture around and we didn't get any sort of email, any sort of notification, anything. And I was like, what if I was just like naked in my den and he just like pops up onto our porch? I think that's illegal, right? I don't know. I don't know. It is 1.18. I've been working all morning and I'm going to take Max on a walk as our exercise today. Okay, let's go. Guess what I think we got in the mail? What? You should open it. It was sent to us. Not sponsored, but it is gifted. I think you're gonna like it. Is it Cholula? <laughs> no, we still haven't been sent Cholula. <laughs> I know, that's all you want in this world. Do you know what it is? I have no idea what this is. It's our own Bluetooth projector with a speaker built into it. Oh. So we can like hang a sheet in our room and have a movie night on a projector. We got gifted this? Yeah. That's cool. I know. I'll link it down below for anyone that's interested, but I think we should try it out this vlog and have a movie night. And yeah, like the head like tilts and stuff. And the speaker's built in, which is nice. It is Bluetooth, right? Does it say Bluetooth, it's Bluetooth on it? Bluetooth, yeah. So I think we could just stream from our devices. I wanna just see what this looks like outside of the box. Ah, ooh, oh wow. He's so cute. He looks like a little robot. There's that. He's so cute. This is like how we got Mary and we love Mary. Mary's our little vacuum robot. Although Mary did vacuum up Brooke's charger the other day. You put it on a tripod. Also, while I'm updating you on things, Manny Me has sent me a couple more nails. They sent me a couple like solids. So like a red and a pink. And I've been saving a couple of the really cute patterned ones for when I'm actually out of the house again because I don't want to waste them just being at home. But I will maybe apply the pink one today. And a lot of you wanted to know how it held up. I figured out the trick. My first set only lasted like maybe seven days, but I had washed my hands a little less than an hour after applying. And I read somewhere that said to make sure to not get them wet at all for the first hour, because that's when the adhesive is like drying. And I didn't know that. So the second time I followed that rule and they lasted like 12 days and it could have lasted longer. I just decided to peel them off because the edges were lifting the slightest bit. So I am very pleased. The first one I was like, Ooh, I wish it lasted longer, but they ended up being pretty great. So I'm gonna make a matcha. I'm gonna go work in my room to get out of this poor working man's hair. Quar hey. Quarantines are up, huh? I'm always in the way. We're always in the way. We're always in each other's way. Every day at like five o'clock, it gets sunny on our porch where the sun actually like touches the porch. And so I try to sit outside for like 30 minutes and like actually get some vitamin D and it feels very nice. So I'm gonna do that for like 30 minutes and then maybe make Brooke some dinner because that sounds like a fun activity. And then it'll be time for game night with the fam. Brooke turned on Harry Potter, which I have never actually seen. Do you know I haven't seen like a single one of them all the way through, but I got this in a subscription box a while back. And it's basically rock cacao, palm sugar, and ashwagandha, and sea salt, and that's it. And I'm having a little bit of that 
in some oat milk as kind of like an afternoon pick me up slash a little treat. Mm -hmm. This is so yummy. You can't have it, you can't have chocolate. But you can give me kisses. Are you gonna play game night with us? Groomers are closed, but look, Max, look at us. We trimmed around his eyes right here. We got the little scissors that are rounded for grooming. <laughs> no, 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 point your head down so we can see your eyes. There you go. Because they were completely blocking his vision. So we just, <laughs> and now he looks so handsome. You need a beard cut, but we'll leave that to the professionals when they're open again. That's not critical to your, your well-being. <laughs> you just look like an old man. That's all. Sweet bubba. We're waiting for my parents to uh, tell me that they're ready to FaceTime and play, but Brooke's getting the things set up. Obviously, we're gonna move it to our room, so hopefully we don't have to reset it up, but, so do you need a app? No, you just connect to the Wi-Fi, I guess. Wow. I just asked Brooke if he has to unplug it later and then plug it back in if, if it would undo all this, and he just told me that it's charged, and so there, you don't even need a plug which is crazy because that means you can literally put it anywhere. I'm already impressed. <laughs> He's connecting it to Wi-Fi right now using the remote, but look what I did. <laughs> Whenever it gets dark outside, I hung a sheet in our room. That's our closet. That's a sheet, that's our bed. It's gonna be awesome. It works on our tripod. Here's the quarantining in style. Things are about- We have a TV. <laughs> yeah, but now we have two. Anywhere we want. You can watch it on the porch. You can watch it in bed. Whoa. I know. Hey! <laughs> hey! Hi, Jacqueline. Hi. Hi. Oh, I see Carolyn. Can you, can you see Dad? Oh, yes. I meant on, I meant on the game. Hi, Dad. Wow. We got it working. Oh man, I'm cozy. We made it even bigger by moving it to our bed. Wow. Good morning. It is Saturday, it's 9 a.m. We stayed up late watching that movie and I think the hardest part about my social media jobs is even, even on Saturdays I have to be up by 9 a.m. to be on the accounts, which is kind of hard some days, but it's okay. Took Max out, just brewed a big pot of coffee, and we have this coffee that I got for Christmas that is the coffee company that catered the bride bar at our wedding. We had a whole like espresso latte bar at our wedding, and estate coffee is based out of San Antonio, and we have a bag from them. So, let me get a coffee cup. Also, our house is a wreck, and I swear I've been cleaning it much more frequently than usual. But I think since we're both always here, it just is continuously getting messy again. <laughs> it's like a never ending cycle. Excuse me, I go to the bathroom and you take my spot? And there's the whole couch. You take my spot? <laughs> it's okay, I like the blinky too. <laughs> I think it's already time for a second cup of coffee. It's one of those kind of mornings. And this is so weird. I've never really liked watching the news, but I've mentioned this in the past, we bought a Hulu Live TV for a month so that I could host bachelor viewing parties for my church. And I've loved watching the news in the morning. Am I an old lady? Is this like, am I officially old? Gotta leave enough for Brooke. <laughs> I've showered just because maintaining hygiene is more important than you realize when you don't have a reason to necessarily maintain hygiene, you know what I mean? So I'm gonna actually get ready halfway as something to do, but also I'm gonna see if I can film any content today. I have a couple like really fun videos that I have planned for this upcoming week, but one of them is a big project and I am actually waiting on a delivery to get here in order to do that. But I might film like a couple little fun bonus things. I'm trying to film as much content as possible right now and push out as much content as possible right now because I haven't talked about this. I I, but uh, my, I think everyone's income on YouTube is dropping pretty rapidly due to the fact that advertisers are pulling their ads placed in videos because they're obviously hurting as companies right now and advertising is normally one of the first things to get cut. So when they're not placing ads in YouTube videos, YouTubers aren't making their mu as much ad sense. So to try to like, negate that as much as possible. I don't know if you noticed last week, the previous week that I'm filming this, I did five videos in one week. So I'm just trying to push out as much 
as I can because um, I know people are kind of sitting at home wanting things to do so they'll watch and hopefully it will help make my pay cut less. My pay has already dropped over a thousand dollars in the last week which is kind of painful but every industry is affected right now so it's a wild 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 time but I might you know get ready and see what creative things come to me today. I also think I want to try to paint today. Would like to try to paint some art kind of similar to that because I think I could pull off that type of you know simple shape line drawing type art. I just filmed like a little spring dress try on for TikTok. Who knows if people like fashion or not but look at this dress. I love this dress except I don't think I'll be able to keep it because it's not my size. Looks great standing up but I literally can't sit down to this. It's probably gonna rip if I do that. So, so sad. It's a really nice dress. Revolve sent it to me and it's definitely above my budget of what I could ever really buy but you know it's fun to at least have a little try on. I took a selfie in it <laughs> and then give it to someone a little bit smaller of hips than me. <laughs> Very tight. <laughs> Cot. <laughs> Boys being cuties. <laughs> you like it when that holds you? <laughs> oh man. Maybe we should have kids because we just treat them like our baby. <laughs> baby Max. Baby Max. Baby Max. Baby Max. You're so cute, do 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 do. You're so cute, do 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 do. You're so cute, do 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 do. He's excited. He's over it. <laughs> oh, he just winked. It's a little bit later in the day, and I just had something very exciting happen, and I won't show you too much, but here I'll show you one little sneak peek. So, do you see the label summer? launch we're already working on it and sneak peek okay that's not the correct colors even it's just kind of like drafts also what's in my hair oh i don't know <laughs> so my uh producer slash friend dropped off this package full of all of the little kind of like drafts i guess you could say and i'm very excited i am so excited for our first launch but i think i might be even more excited for the summer launch too assuming that happens <laughs> I don't really know what our plan is as of now um, as to when we'll launch with everything going on. So TBD, stay tuned. I'm gonna figure out what makes the most sense. But I know Brooke has to work. I've been distracting him. I might take Max out and I got paint paper and I want to try to watercolor or something. And Kaylee's told me about a good documentary called Evil Genius. So if Brooke's okay with that being played in the background, I kind of want to paint and watch that because I think that sounds like a fun Saturday activity. Let's go ask. Hey. I have a question. You want to watch the documentary? Yeah. Can I, can I turn on while you work? Sure. Mix. Mix. He jump. Oh, he jump. Mix. Look at how dirty our room is. You get so distracted. Mix. <laughs> Mix. Mix. He's trying so hard. <laughs> Oh, buddy. Cute. Ear scratch. Oh, oh yeah. Cherry, Ear scratch. Ready? <laughs> Good catch. I couldn't have, finally. But I set up a little painting station, even though I'm the worst painter in the whole wide world. And I made that same ashwagandha hot chocolate. Ashwagandha squash banana. Say ashwagandha squash banana. Yeah, that's from Wild Cube. Anyways, I have my paper. I have the water, a plate for these types of paints. Got a ton of those. I got like the child type, some colored pencils and some paint brushes and I'm probably gonna make a mess, but I'm also gonna turn on that Netflix docu-series. What's it called? Evil Genius. Oh, apparently I've seen the first two episodes, but I don't remember it, so we'll find out. Hello, Ramona. I can't shake the simplest feeling beyond the ghost. We stand on Hey, guess what? Made a what? plant that looks like a pineapple on accident. I also made shapes. Dude, I knew that this paper wasn't good for paint. Brooke asked me to try to paint him Max, but I don't have white paint. So I'm gonna paint a golden Max. Is that okay? Golden Max. Okay. Also, this documentary is wild. What are y'all doing over there? Dishes. Oh yeah? Do you need to go hug some friends or something? <laughs> yeah, you need some physical touch in your life. Oh, hi Max. I'm trying to draw you Max. You kind of look like Chewbacca right now. <laughs> He put him on the counter! Savage! <laughs> Max is like, what am I doing? I drew you 
Chewbacca. Looks just like him. <laughs> He's very yellow. I don't have white paint, nor can I paint. Well, in my pineapple, <laughs> in my blobs. <laughs> okay, I made you the weirdest meal. It's rice and beans and zucchini and avocado and eggs and cheese. <laughs> eggs. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> 14. And you could add Cholula. So. Weekend things to do when you can't leave your house. Paint, virtual game night, make a movie theater in your home. Are you apologizing? Are you apologizing? He, uh, I was loving on him and he like barked in my face that I like fell backwards and kind of got a little bit sad. So is this an apology? Thank you. Thank you. I think he knows he made me sad. <laughs> I just went love. <laughs> what was I saying? Oh yeah, try to make weird meals out of the few remaining ingredients you have left. And those were all of my ideas, so we're gonna have another movie night, this time in this room. And if you don't know this, oh, buddy. <laughs> if you don't know this about me, my favorite genre of movies specifically is any sort of spy movie, any sort of like CIA, FBI, murder, Nancy Drew. <laughs> Are you being crazy again? He gets so weird, I, I swear. If any of y'all know what this behavior is, where he goes from like loving to like growling and biting, it's really weird. We would try to have grace with him because we don't know his past, but sometimes it's a little bit scary. You hear that? Should I stop? Okay. Anyways, we found a new kind of like spy-ish movie that I've never heard of and Brooke hasn't heard of either, which he's the movie guy. Called Criminal? With what's his face? Do you recognize that dude? I should know his name. It's like one of the Ryans or one of the Jakes or one of them, you know. That's our plans for the rest of the night. I hope that y'all are having a safe and a happy and a hopefully not too stir crazy weekend at your homes as well during all of this. This is coming out the following weekend. Um, hopefully things are looking up by the time this video comes out. Hopefully we're making improvement and the world's getting healthier and healthier, but I love y'all so much. I hope you have the best rest of your day and I will see you in a video very soon. Bye.